Hello, high level listeners. Welcome to the start of week four in our five week English for Travel speaking course, where we'll take your travel English to the next level with real American and British English. Today, our first dialogue will be about using public transportation. In the dialogue, I'll be a tourist visiting a popular destination, and Mark will be a local person who gives me some useful advice about taking public transportation in the area. Yes, that's right. Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining us. I'm Mark, your British teacher, and together with Kat from the USA, we make up High Level Listening. And this English for Travel course is designed to improve your English speaking confidence, expand your vocabulary, and train your ear for both American and British English. So we have five weeks of travel topics for you with five new videos every week this month. Our topic this week is taking public transportation. Like the previous units, we'll start with a full conversational dialogue to enhance your listening skills in both American and British English. Yes, we'll be releasing a new video each day from Monday to Friday on YouTube for free. But if you prefer not to wait, you can access all five of this unit's videos right now by purchasing the English for Travel course in our high level listening store. Along with these videos, you'll also get downloadable MP3 versions with no ads. There are worksheet pages, picture dictionaries, pronunciation guides and homework activities in there as well. You can click the link in the description below to get all of that right now. So let's get started with the dialogue and listening practice. When you travel, you often want to avoid getting lost or spending a lot of extra money that you don't need to. So asking locals for advice is a great way to get around more easily and cheaply. To make the most out of today's class, try listening without the subtitles for the first time. We'll go through the conversation once at normal speed, then a little bit more slowly, and finally one more time at normal speed. So, get ready, let's go. Hi there, could you give me some pointers on getting around the area near the ferry terminal? I'm a little turned around. Sure, no worries. What do you need help with? So, we rented a car and need to find a place to park near the terminal. The main parking area looks pretty expensive. Is there a cheaper spot nearby? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, instead of parking at the main car park, just drive past it. Don't worry about the parking attendants trying to direct you. Trust me, there's a smaller, cheaper one a bit further down. You'll be a bit further away from the ferry terminal, but it's where all the locals park. Oh, great. That's exactly what I was looking for. After I park, how do I get to the ferry terminal? It's really easy. Once you park, just walk up to the terminal. You'll see loads of touts and scalpers trying to sell you tickets. Just ignore them and go straight to the official ticket booth inside. Thanks for the tip. I, I don't want to get ripped off. After I get my ticket and take the ferry across, what's the best way to get around on the other side? Are there taxis or buses available? Yes, there are both. Uh, but my advice would be to stick to the taxis. You'll see them all lined up when you get off the ferry. Remember to only use the taxis from the official rank. They're safe and reliable. And what about the buses? If you still want to use the buses, you might want to get an all-day travel pass. It's more economical if you're making multiple trips. Oh, that's a great idea. <laughs> Where can I buy one? You can get it at the ferry terminal or any of the main bus stops. Just ask the staff and they'll point you in the right direction. Okay, got it. Thanks for the extra tip. I'll make sure to get one. Oh, you have been so helpful. I, I just have one more question, if you don't mind. Um, I'm planning to explore all day, but I don't want to stay overnight. When's the last ferry back? The last ferry is at 6 p.m., so make sure you're back at the terminal before then. It's a good idea to get there a bit early as well to avoid the rush. Awesome. Oh, thanks for the heads up. Oh, I really appreciate your help. This makes my trip so much easier. Of course. Have a great trip. All right, so we listened through it once, and I hope that you were able to pick up lots of great vocabulary, lots of great information. Let's go through it one more time, a little bit slower. Hi there. Could you give me some pointers on getting around the area near the ferry terminal? I'm a little turned around. Sure, no worries. What do you need help with? So, 
We rented a car and need to find a place to park near the terminal. The main parking area looks pretty expensive. Is there a cheaper spot nearby? Absolutely. Instead of parking at the main car park, just drive past it. Don't worry about the parking attendants trying to direct you. Trust me, there's a smaller, cheaper one a bit further down. You will be a bit further away from the ferry terminal, but it's where all the locals park. Oh, great. That's exactly what I was looking for. After I park, how do I get to the ferry terminal? It's really easy. Once you park, just walk up to the terminal. You'll see a load of touts and scalpers trying to sell you tickets. Just ignore them and go straight to the official ticket booth inside. Oh, thanks for the tip. I don't want to get ripped off. After I get my ticket and take the ferry across, what's the best way to get around on the other side? Are there taxis or buses available? Yes, there are both, but my advice would be to stick to the taxis. You will see them all lined up when you get off the ferry. Remember to only use the taxis from the official rank. They are safe and reliable. Uh, what about the buses? If you still want to use the buses, you might want to get an all-day travel pass. It's more economical if you're making multiple trips. That's a great idea. Where can I buy one? You can get it at the ferry terminal or any of the main bus stops. Just ask the staff and they will point you in the right direction. Got it. Thanks for the extra tip. I'll make sure to get one. Oh, you have been so helpful. I just have one more question, if you don't mind. I'm planning to explore all day, but I don't want to stay overnight. When's the last ferry back? Last ferry is at 6 p.m. So make sure you're back at the terminal before then. It's a good idea to get there a bit early to avoid the rush. Awesome. Thanks for the heads up. I really appreciate your help. This makes my trip so much easier. Of course. Have a great trip. All right. So we hope you understood even more. So now let's go through it once more at the normal pace. Uh, hi there. Could you give me some pointers on getting around the area near the ferry terminal? I'm a little turned around. Sure, no worries. What do you need help with? So, we rented a car and need to find a place to park near the terminal. The main parking area looks so expensive. Is there a cheaper spot nearby? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, instead of parking at the main car park, just drive past it. Don't worry about the parking attendants trying to direct you. Trust me, there's a smaller, cheaper one a bit further down. You'll be a bit further away from the ferry terminal, but it's where all the locals park. Oh, great. That's exactly what I was looking for. Uh, after I park, how do I get to the ferry terminal? Pretty easy. Once you park, just walk up to the terminal. You'll see loads of touts and scalpers trying to sell you tickets. Just ignore them and go straight to the official ticket booth inside. Oh, thanks for the tip. I don't want to get ripped off. After I get my ticket and take the ferry across, what's the best way to get around on the other side? Are there taxis or buses available? Uh, yes, there are both. But my advice would be to stick to the taxis. You'll see them all lined up when you get off the ferry. Remember to only use taxis from the official rank. They're safe and reliable. Uh, so what about the buses? If you still want to use the buses, you might want to get an all-day travel pass. It's more economical if you're making multiple trips. Ah, uh, that's a great idea. Uh, where can I buy one? You can get it at the ferry terminal or any of the main bus stops. Just ask the staff and they'll point you in the right direction. Got it. Thanks for the extra tip. I'll make sure to get one. 
You have been so helpful. I, I just have one more question, if you don't mind. I'm planning to explore all day, but I don't want to stay overnight. What's When's the last ferry back? The last ferry is at 6 p.m., so make sure you're back at the terminal before then. It's also a good idea to get there a bit early to avoid the rush. Awesome. Thanks for the heads up. I really appreciate your help. This makes my trip so much easier. Of course. Have a great trip. All right. Great job, everyone. Remember, this is just the first class of five super helpful videos we released this week, so I hope you're excited for the next class. If you don't want to wait and you want extra bonus materials like PDF transcripts, bonus worksheets, MP3s, a picture dictionary, and lots more, you can access the full fourth unit of the course via the link below right now. Yes, and did you hear or learn anything new in today's dialogue? What was your favorite phrase from our conversation? Please share it with us in the comments below. Thank you so much for joining us. Once again, don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the little bell as well so you never miss a video. And we'll see you tomorrow for the next class. Bye-bye.